Hi there, I'm Bruno Sa, and today I'm here in Budapest, Hungary. Uh, we are on tour, I'm on tour with Operation Mind Crime, Jeff Tate celebrating the 30th anniversary of Operation Mind Crime, and Angra. So, uh, we are getting ready to do the sound check, the Operation Mind Crime sound check, and I just did a sound check with the guys from Angra. Now I'm getting ready for the second sound check of the night. I play two shows every night, so I just thought it would be a cool uh, moment to make a quick rundown of my equipment, the equipment that I'm using on tour. So to start with, with the keyboards. Uh, I'm currently endorsed, proudly endorsed by Casio, and I'm using this amazing uh, uh, stage piano and keyboard controller. On the previous series, it's called the PX5S. All right, and it's very—it's a very light keyboard to carry around. It's an, it has only uh, uh, 11 kilos, if, I'm, if I get it right. It's really light, especially compared to my other uh, gear, my uh, my other uh, uh, 88 weighted, fully weighted uh, keyboards, as I like. <clears throat> to play a uh, piano and, and I, I love the feel of it you know I usually I'm usually always using an 88 keyboards uh, just to some auxiliary sounds mostly in case of anger I'm also using another controller that's a chord one it's a micro micro key all right and right now it's not uh, activated to uh, to any sounds okay and actually the Casio I use uh, it's all sounds when he when we are doing the acoustic shows it has an incredible piano sound and again not only the feel of the keys uh, of the mechanics is amazing but also the texture of it is really nice we kind of try to replicate the feeling of ebony and ivory so I'm pretty happy with that all right, and here you can see my little add-on, my USB fan. So it makes me cool on stage. You know, Steve I taught me that. All right. So besides the keyboards, I'm also proudly endorsed by KeyPro Stand. As you can see, this amazing tower-shaped stand allows me to to a, a, a great amount of freedom on stage because not only it spins but I can tilt the keyboards like it is like they are right now right so it's cool so the audience can look at your hands while you're playing um, let me see after that oh all the like I said all the sounds are coming from my MacBook okay on this floor I'm using the keyboards in the electric shows only as controllers all right so here you can see that's my interface all right i'm using a focus right a 2i4 this is my wireless uh, microphone a sure my headset microphone and <clears throat> for the keys not only for the keys but for the guitar as well because i'm playing guitar i play guitar with jeff Tate. So, in many of the songs where there are no keyboards, I'm playing like a third uh, guitar, especially because uh, the uh, uh, Queen's Right material and Operation Mind Crimes material, uh, they have lots of <coughs> uh, uh, harmony solos, and, why, and that allows me to, you know, that allows the guys uh, uh, to be free to do the harmonies while I'll keep doing the riffs. So this is pretty cool. And not only the guitar not only the guitar and also the keyboards, I'm running it through uh, main stage on Mac. For those do, who don't know it, uh, main stage is it's pretty much like uh, a stage version of Logic. So here I can program everything, have all my sounds, alright, and this is the way I make it look like you can customize everything. So right now you can see this is an anger song and I'm using this is my tuner all right and I'm using this Bluetooth pedal 
to switch between the sounds. So this goes to the next okay. sound, this goes back to the previous sound. As you can see, and right there on the screen, <coughs> I just make some notes about the sounds. <laughs> you can hear right now some auspicious uh, tracks from Operation Minecraft, right? <laughs> so, anyway, so here, the intro theme, I'm using fast strings, and I just put some harmony there, you know, working with two bands every night, eventually you might end up forgetting a little detail, so I think it's good just to leave some notes there, okay, with the sounds, okay, and you see I'm changing, I'm just pressing the pedals and going through every section of the songs, okay, <clears throat> so this is pretty much how it works, and not any it gives you, it allows you the cool thing of you can like hold your sound. And I'm gonna change the sounds there. See, and if I release the keys and press them again, that's the sound is actually changed. So this is quite a cool feature that it allows me to change the sounds and still keep playing the previous one. And when I hit the keys again, that, that's the moment when the sound actually changes all right so thank you very much for watching this and i hope i'll see you in, on on the road like my our great keyboard player uh and master jordan really says all right so all the best and hope to see you soon